go and see the book or the sketchbook song about the images. This image is in one of my in my channel. I use it this ones because I made some of poetry which is about mother when I go to the moon or when I climb up to the moon. So that's what it is. You can see here the stairs going to the moon. And here is a field with uh, beautiful purple flowers and yellow flowers with butterflies and a lot of trees here. Here is the sun and the moon. And here is the, again the same field that I just showed to you. But, um, well, I wanted to recreate it again and I did it. Uh, just sometimes I like to do two or three times. Maybe maybe the next one will come better. Sometimes I'm not able to achieve that. But anyway, as long if I do it again and again. You never know. Um, practice makes the master. So, and here, another image. Another bird. Okay. Sometimes like just doodles. As long as I give the color, and this one, well, it's the little bird with a kid, and also a little basket. I think this is about a story that I had written somewhere, but it's about it, that she wanted to, she was dreaming that she wanted to take uh, some of her toys because she had too many toys or something but she wanted she took the toys to the to the to the kids to kids that were had no toys and had no balloons and she could not go because she had no means to go and the bird came and took her to give these toys to those kids that they had no toys it's something about this story I wrote it some time ago and well is there somewhere on my um, you know on my uh, in the memory on my PC so here is another one this is also the moon and the owl is carrying her she's very happy here is a little some kind of um, bottle or something with a flower and this is another bird. And this is another image and birds. And these just faces. A couple of faces with a couple of leaves and mouths. And here again the moon. And this is the very I have no idea how do you say coqueta in English, but that's what it is, la luna. Okay, and these are the faces of the moon. This is 2014. And then we go to this one, which is La Niña de los Pirulis, the girl of the popsicles, you know, with the shape of this. Oh, when I was a kid, I used to love this pirulis. Oh, and they came with the crystal clear, uh, like acetate they were covering, and they were many colors and many flavors i believe too they have flavors but i just love them because they were so colorful and oh. so yes this is me with all my pito leaves and here is another one the little lot of balloons and here is the little butterfly and she's going and she wanted to she wanted to fly on a swing. Butterflies fly, yes, but she wanted to fly in a swing because she saw always the crows playing in the swing. And she wanted to fly in the swing. So one day she was able to do it and balloons took her away. Higher and higher and higher. And then the little girl, she says, oh, and then the other little her friend or sister she went ee, and then 
the little doggy one. You and then the little mouse went ah and then the little bird just went a so that's what happened there. And then here is another one. And she's also having one piruli. And she has she's very happy because she has her piruli. And well, has little decorations. And then there's the boy. Him. He has to have a piruli too. And here is an image that I make. Uh, but anyway, I I just, this is an image of, you know, the saddest moments of kids, or at least speaking of my experience. They are drinking, and this is part of me, my father was alcoholic, and this is a dream that I saw. Him and his friends, they were happy, happy, happy. And I was just standing somewhere here watching them. Happy for something that makes me very sad and suffer. But that's life. What makes you happy not necessarily makes happy the rest around you. And this is other one. It's about a building, and you know, and the little girl is watching how the little bo bocho, bochito, or the Volkswagen is coming down the building. And here it is life is just one shine on it. That's what it says. And each one represents little uh, animals or some sort of an image. It's a little girl drawing of a little girl which I saw this little girl one time and I was with a friend we went to a coffee place and this little girl was there with her mama oh my goodness and I saw I thought angels were like that well, at least that's what I thought when I saw her she smiled at me and she had this beautiful bow on her on her head, beautiful, beautiful curly hair, curly, 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 curly hair. And her mother looked so happy. I just love to see the way they both look. And so I, of course, I, I could never capture what I saw when I saw her it's just this is my description but I will never ever ever be able to capture that I mean see her smile and the mother smile and see then that bond it's just for a speckle of a second I just felt like I was watching an angel and and I just had to have to have to draw her and that's what it means this to remind me that when I saw her that's what I saw a little angel she smiled at me so this one is another one it's about also about a poetry that I wrote and it's, it's about words, you know, that words are important to say and it's better to speak. Many times it's better to speak than stay quiet. Yes, and maybe sometimes what we hear or what we say maybe hurts, but maybe in long uh, the long and the long term maybe it's better or no maybe many times it's better so and then it's another mouth another um, 
mouth that wants to speak or speak. And this is a little mother with a little one, and it's about my one of my poetries, and it's, she's just saying, me, my own mother or mommy when I grew up. Well, what she want to do when she grows up. And this is the same image they have to use in the same poetry. And, and this is the same legend, and because it's about the same poem. Also this one. It describes the poem a little bit. I also related to that one. That's the one too. And this one also. And I believe this is the last drawing that I did thinking about that poem. Oh, actually this one. And this one is about the same, but now in this case, the little girl is saying to her father, Daddy, when I grow up, what she wants to be. And she wants to be a doctor to cure him from his alcoholism. That was my dream. Yes, but my dream never came true. And, and yes, when you drink, or when the person drinks, or when the person is alcoholic, he or she has a secure path to death. So, that's what it is. And here is growing, growing the corn, which is very important for the food in our, in, you know, in our country, which is Mexico. Corn is essential for us Mexicans. And here is the mother, and she is planting the corn while the man is growing, I mean, um, harvesting or preparing the land for. And, the, and her little kid is here playing, playing with the little doggy. Yes. And so here is another lady, which is growing and putting seeds in the little bird hug um, in her hand. This is her again, some way, somehow, you know, the nest came down and the tree was damaged or something happened to the tree, so she's carrying the tree and she's planted again. And the bird is here with her is like saying thank you and I say thank you because you are going to you are taking care of my nest and you are helping me to to taking care of my babies my future babies to be and a little dragonflies and more butterflies okay and I and then see this an image 19 I mean um, 16 uh, in 2016 there is another one I think this one where it stamps and I just put a little bit of color this is just making little stars this one's a little bird with a Christmas you know her house is quite decorated with a Christmas motif and the baby is, wants to eat. And this is a beautiful hummingbird and she is um, putting the ball on the present and the present is uh, for Christmas is with lots of love. Love, 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 love. And, then, mm, and that's the present, love. And here is a little mouse. And just enjoying home. There is another little mouse. And I believe that's it. So thank you very much. And till next time. Ilesama.